This assessment is automatically administered to the students at the beginning of every chapter and once more at the end of each track. Our list of most common words is correlated to Fry's word list. For tracks 1 through 3, we have the first 300 most common words that are divided into 22 lists. For the kindergarten track, we have the first 30 most common words that are divided into 8 lists. The test is administered and functions as follows. The student is made aware that there will be three options shown on the screen. The narrator will say one of those words, and the student must then identify the correct word before the six-second timer runs out. The student presses the arrow button to begin. The student is given each word from list one, one at a time, then each subsequent list. Because this is a rapid recognition assessment, the first word the student clicks on is submitted as the answer. There is no submit button on this test. If the six-second timer runs out, the assessment is paused. That word is counted as being wrong, and the student must press the arrow button to resume the assessment and receive the next word. The assessment can be terminated in two ways. If the student gets 40% or less correct on any given word list, the assessment will be terminated. If the student identifies the wrong word three times in a row, the assessment will be terminated. The assessment continues as long as neither of these conditions is met. When the assessment ends or is terminated, the students will be shown the list for which they were tested. Each list will show one, two, or three stars to visually indicate how they did on that list. Each list with a green check mark indicates that the list was passed off and the most common word lesson will be overridden. A red X indicates that the list was not passed off. The lists with green check marks will not be included in the next MCW assessment. Administrators can set the minimum required passing percentage on the student's option tab in the administration portal. This passing percentage is the score required in order to bypass the list in the lesson sequence. It is also the score required for the individual most common word lessons. The most common word assessment is very dynamic and prescriptive. Each subsequent time the assessment is given, the lists that were passed off in previous attempts are not included in the assessment. If the student passes off all 22 word lists, or 8 word lists for the kindergarten track, then the assessment is not given again and all the most common word lessons are overridden if they have not already been taken. To access the most common word assessment summary report, click on the assessment section in the student summary report. Then click on the most common word assessment tab. The report shows the results for each time the assessment has been taken. Double-click an event to see a more detailed report that shows the lists tested and the score for each list. Double-click on a list to see the words that list contains and how the student performed. A green check mark indicates the students identified the word correctly. A red X indicates the student did not correctly identify the word. The footer shows the student's best score and the average best of the group being shown.